Hi everyone, so today I'm going to do this look for you. It's a really lovely galaxy look. Um, so the first thing I'm going to use is my Gold Light Strobing Cream from MAC. This is, gives me a really lovely dewy complexion and makes me glow. I'm just popping on my foundation. I've mixed in uh, EX1 and Bourjois foundation just so it makes my skin a little bit lighter because I've got two really dark shades and yeah I'm just going to blend that in with my Neverland brushes. I'm just going to pat the foundation in whilst I uh, spread it as well that's just to give it a little bit more of a uh, flawless complexion. <laughs> Now I'm grabbing my Wake Me Up Concealer and just popping it underneath my eyes to obviously wake me up a little bit because I am absolutely knackered today and yeah I'm just going to put this quite a lot underneath my eyes and then with my beauty blender I'm just going to pat it in. D translucent powder. I'm just going to bake my under eyes and then sweep it away with the boot blender because I don't want intense baking. I just want, you know, uh, no creases. Then I'm going to go on to my contour and I'm going to get my contouring brush and my hula by Benefit and just carve out my cheekbones, my jawline, and the other cheekbone. <laughs> going to do the top of my head just so it brings all the bronzing together and makes my face look smaller. Now I'm just wiping away any excess powder with my Body Shop foundation powder. Now going on to my eyebrows I'm using the conditioning serum by Benefit just to comb them into place and also make them a little bit softer and I'm just gonna skip this part really quickly because Everyone's seen how I do my eyebrows. And now we're onto the eyes. So I've taken a really light beige color from the 350p palette. And now I'm taking a warmer color and just putting it in the outer. And now I'm taking a burgundy color from the same palette and I'm just deepening the outer V again, a little bit lower than we did the other colours so it makes a kind of gradient look. Now I'm taking a pale purple and smoking out, adding in a dark purple into the outer corner just for a little bit of depth. I'm taking the purple again and just keep deepening as I go. Now I'm taking a black to deepen just so it creates more depth and we have the purple and the black which are on top of each other. Now I'm taking this metallic makeup revolution eyeshadow which I mix with a glitter serum so it stays together on my eye and this is absolutely beautiful. I think this is in black diamond. I'm not sure if they're available anymore but I'm just going to pat that on with a packing brush and then I'm going to diffuse it out with my finger just so the glitter is dispersed evenly. Now I'm getting a black and I'm just popping it in the outer corner just to deepen it a little bit. And I'm smoking out the purple once again over the top of the metallic. Now I'm taking a really bright purple from the same palette, 
and I'm using a really thin brush just to uh, smoke out the bottom lash line and I'm going to leave a little gap at the front because that's where I'm going to fill in with glitter in a little while. So as you can see I left a little gap and I'm just going to fill in that gap with glitter. I'm going to go back in with the bright purple and deepen and intensify the bottom lash. I'm taking my Double Gleam by MAC which is a new highlighter and just popping it in the inner corner to make it pop. Now I'm just applying roller lash before I put my fake eyelashes on. I'm using Sephora lashes. I'm not 100% sure which ones these are. I forgot their name, but they're really pretty. I'm taking the tattoo liner by Kat Von D and I'm just covering up the glue uh, from where the lashes are sitting on the eye, just to blend them into the eyelashes a little bit more. Now I'm taking Double Gleam by MAC again and I'm just highlighting my face. Taking it on the end of my nose, not the whole nose, just the end. And I'm applying a Marc Jacobs Coal Eyeliner to the top layer of my eye. I'm now going to apply my lipstick which is Queen Bee by Too Faced and I absolutely love this colour and I think it goes really good with this look as well. I'm going to take Double Gleam once again and I'm just going to frost the lips up a little bit and mattify them a little bit more. And pretty much that's done. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I really hope you've enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and let me know what you think in the comments. See you later.